Anything that you have ever seen, heard, or felt is made up of atoms, which form different states of matter based on the ways that they interact with one another. The three most famous states are those of solid, liquid, and gas, whose atoms have decreasing densities and consequently increasing speeds. The fourth state of matter is found when gas is heated to extremely high temperatures and ionizes to form plasma, which, while interesting, is not what we'll focus on today. As the temperature of atoms decreases, they slow down and move towards each other, but strange things begin to happen the closer they get to absolute coldness, also known as zero Kelvin. As their temperature nears absolute zero, the particles get so close together that they begin to merge into entirely new states of matter. The laws of quantum mechanics tell us that there are two categories of particles distinguished by values known as spins. Bosons, which have integer spins, and fermions, which have half integer spins. Bosons love to get together and combine fairly easily. Fermions, on the other hand, hate each other and do their best to stay apart. Because of this, it was originally only thought that bosons could exist in this merged form. However, in 2003, a team of scientists used a magnetic field to play Cupid and bond together the antisocial fermions. Since halves add up to a whole, the fermion spins were now integers and they gained boson-like properties, allowing them to merge into an entirely new state of matter called a fermion condensate. Using what we've discovered about this new state, which has been nicknamed a superfluid, we can help to improve superconductors, leading to cheaper electricity and faster computers. But that's a discussion for another day. Until then, never forget to keep asking questions.